now. Less thank you. You don't gotta thank me. You are a very talented artist who deserves lots and lots of commissions. Everyone should give Lexi their money. They think I should play Storm in this deck? If you need anything, Lexi, you know where I am. Always on Twitch or Discord or Twitter. I'm a message away. Oh, thank you! What do you mean, Alistray? Give me a link to give money then. I think Lexi has a coffee. She can post it if she wants to. If you want to help out a little bit. She's in a rough financial situation. Nixus, thank you for the two years with the Prime Gaming. Am I allowed to do that? Yeah. Go ahead. Go right ahead. I trust you. I've known you for like six years. If I'm able to help out by spreading word, that's good enough for me. If people want to give, give and help a little bit. I do not mind. Just post it right up. Nixus, thank you for the two years with the Prime, though. I greatly appreciate it. Go support Lexi. She supported me for freaking ever. Hey, I finally got rescue. Take that, cat. She didn't. She had this card, and I didn't have it. Don't want to take away from you. Ah, don't worry about me. Don't you worry about me. These these people give me enough. I was watching someone's video on YouTuber and Chibi Acer subbed, and I was like, oh my god, I know that person. It's cool seeing people I know from this community popping up in other places. Oh! Yo, Ch wait, who are you watching? Chibi subbed to them? Yo, wait. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. I'm gonna be relying on Zabu a lot in this deck. Holy shit. Burr's a millionaire streamer. Yeah, me and my 40 average, me and my 50 to 60 average viewers. And my 10,000 subs on YouTube is a millionaire streamer. I'm gonna bring out the Beta Ray Bill. Bringing out the Beta Ray Bill. I don't know why the game thought Storm would be good, but that's okay. Hey, every time I see someone from this community in the chat that's not here, Burgo with Fi Fi, insert the Spider Man emote here. It's fun. It's fun seeing you guys are scattered around. Jubilee's coming in. Okay. Cards can't be played here. I fucking should have played Howard the Duck in the middle. God damn it. God. Jesus, man. Are you kidding me? Okay. I do have Jeff. Oh, fuck. Okay. Well, that changes everything. Might throw beta rate build down on the left. I didn't get... I need to get Zabu and Jeff. Okay, well, you have Wave. There's Zabu. I'm gonna throw my Doom bots in. Opponent snapped. I could throw Magneto on the right and really screw him if he plays a three or four cost, but he's probably going to play a six cost. Bro, I only have a duck. Galactus, very good call, Jelly Bottoms. Very good call. I only had a duck. I mean, I have Jane Foster and Magneto, and I have... Thor popping up. Every time I run into Burn, someone else is streaming, says, hey, but it feels like when your dad shows up at some place, you're hanging out, and you're like, shit, I gotta be on my best behavior now. <laughs> Talking about phase stream. That's why I catch you the most, Alistray. Gonna lurk and get some sleep. Good luck with your games. Thanks for hanging out, baby bat, and thank you again for trusting me with the community of gamers. It's very much appreciated. Is he gonna Alioth on this last turn? I gotta see if it's an Alioth. Let's see. 
Ugh, it was. Ugh. Also, hey, Robin. Good morning. Well, my first game with my uh, my new my uh, beta ray build deck uh, went horribly wrong. Ugh, so boring. So boring. I don't need two Howard the Ducks as much as I would like that. They're probably having a nebula there. Deadpool. Okay, great. A, a location that benefits destroy? Never. They, I would never have a location that benefits destroy comps. That seems way too weird. Discovered that a fun thing to do against Galactus is playing Titania with priority on his lane. That means you need to get priority, though. Okay, he's got Deadpools everywhere. This should have... Honestly, this should already be a fucking retreat. This should already be a retreat, but I'm not going to do it. I can do this. I can do this. What a game! If Beta Ray Bill pops up next, we're in we are in good company. Come on, Beta Ray Bill. That's Zabu. Hear me out. Howard! I wasn't even I using him. I definitely need to change my underwear. I definitely need to change my underwear. What a game! Wind, aid my hand. That'll scare him. Well, this beta ray bill. And then hear me out again. We put a Doc Ock here. And I pull out the null. And then I lose. Thank you guys for the help. Of course, Lexi. Of course. Being able to help is best thing in the world, you know? Always help where you can. Oh, they played dead. Oh, and they played Deadpool. Oh, I lose. Oh, I lost. Okay, destroy comps, strike again. Escaped. That carnage would have been nice. Hey, remember when someone asked how to climb the infinite? Leave in a game like that. My cubes. Dude, I've been in the 70s the entire season, and now I got banned. For being too handsome. Let me have this. I know I didn't get banned. Just let me have this. LK Tongue. Man, I have this tendency to play all these hands that have way too much power associated to them. I, I just play hands. I should just play a zoo deck. There's got to be a good zoo deck, right? Yeah, Robin, we're at the 3,000 plus collection level or 4,000 plus collection level where you go up against everybody and it's a really hard to climb because everybody has every single card ever. And it's like, oh, I lose. You're playing zoo at the moment. What type of zoo you got? You got Mockingbird in there? Face the might of Asgard. I played against one freaking hammer deck and I was like, oh, that sounds like a lot of fun. I really like zoo decks. I'm gonna make sure we do not go to the Mindscape. Maybe they'll do that too.
He has a Shang-Chi. Well, I mean, if I play the Stormbreaker, I know what's gonna fucking happen. <laughs> I know what's happening if I play that Stormbreaker. Are you kidding me? My life will be over. Okay, good combo. I have Jubilee and Iron Lad. That'll be three costs with Zabu. I can put Jubilee in the middle. I'll have two extra energy, so I'll have eight energy. He left. He had a Shang-Chi and he left. Punch with Mysterio, Patriot, Mockingbird deck. I received a copy of something. What? I just received gifts. Wait a minute. I have to hide the monitor for a second. I just received gifts on Steam via an email. Wait a minute. What's up, anime girl Naruto? How are you doing? Mr. Monk has sent me two gifts. Blasphemous and rad. Hey, thanks, Monk. I absolutely loved Blasphemous, too. So Blasphemous will be a very fun game to hopefully play one day. Any of you ever played Blasphemous? Because I've only played Blasphemous, too. And that was one of my favorite Metroidvanias ever. That game was fucking awesome. Thanks, Monk. I appreciate that. I, I Every Steam sale, I'm always eyeing Blasphemous 1. Fellas, is it gay to play Blasphemous after marbles? <laughs> Haven't played it. It has some pretty uh, weird art, we can all say, but honestly, it's a fantastic game. Blasphemous 2. I watched Mushu play the original Blasphemous. Uh, when Blasphemous 2 came out, because I think she wanted to play that. I'm getting Odin. They like my Howard. Does does anyone have a zoo comp with Howard the Duck? My bestie. Bestie Howard. Phil. God. Okay, I'm getting Jeff next turn. I could play Jubilee, depending on what I get. Magneto. I could pull Magneto out. Or I could have Iron Lad take the Magneto power. Masha. Masha. That's her name. Masha. I love Masha. I could play Bill. Then if he moves here, he still has the plower. The, the plower. The power. I'll play Bill. Bill! 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 Ah. Stormbreakers next. Here, I'll do this. Get that Stormbreaker power. She is still doing the stream thing. She, uh, last I saw, she was playing through Final Fantasy... She was playing through Final Fantasy, the new one, actually. If I play Jubilee, I'm getting 10 power here. I don't know if that's actually worth it. If I play Jubilee here, I'm going to have like 7 power. Jeffrey is not going to do anything, so maybe I just go for this. Knowing my luck, they're going to play Shang-Chi on the left. I have Jane Foster coming, so I'm going to have... God, the negative zone is really killing me. I'm only going to have, like, three power here. Honestly, it could be worth it. Oh, they left. And they left. You averaged one hour and 32 minutes of screen time per day last week. Eh, not bad. Probably me trying to find out what's... What find a good Spotify song while taking a shower. Uh, 
Okay, wait. I actually kind of want to use a zoo deck. Archetypes. Move Summers, discard Dracula. This is the type of... Wait, this actually looks kind of fun too. Discard Dracula? That one looks kind of fun. One has some nudity. There were some in Blasphemous too. There's, uh, in Blasphemous 2, there's the scene where, uh, you're saving the children and there's that guy m squeezing milk out of his tit onto a baby. If you've never seen Blasphemous, that sounds incredibly weird, I know, but that's what happens. That's one of the most popular discard decks. This one? I like this one, honestly. And I have all the cards. Blade, Morbius, Collector. That's a basic discard deck. Wait, what happens if I click it? Oh, it teaches you how to play? That's a basic-ass deck. Oh, current discard builds? Dude, I don't know. Just show me decks. Oh, wait. Archetype. Uh, can I just, like, look up Zoo? Zoo. Avenger Zoo? God, I can't type. Snap fan? Dex. Search keywords. Zoo. Apply. Kazoo pop. 60% win rate. God damn. What up, Joel? I want a good zoo deck. Oh, that's a fucking basic zoo deck. Uh, cards... I want Mockingbird in the zoo. Can I not look up Mockingbird? Oh, there she is. Apply the filters. Zoo. Ant-Man, Nico, Squirrel Girl, Titania, Dazzler, Shanna, Mobius, Kazar, Call, Blue Marvel, Mockingbird. No. Mockingbird Zoo. Dude, I don't have Mobius or fucking Alioth. I do have this. I don't have Pixie. This one has a 48% win rate, though. Created three hours ago. Why Titania? Is she uh, one of the cards you play last? Where's Patriot in this deck as well? I mean, Patriot kind of there. Thanos Zoo with Mockingbird. Oh, I don't think about that one. I don't even have Thanos. Man, freaking... Mo if I knew Mobius was so good with Zoo. Has a YouTube video. Unleash the Zoo. I don't have Martyr. I do have Titania, though. Valkyrie I'd need to be careful with, but... Why Iron Man? I don't trust some of these zoos. Okay, we'll just do Mockingbird cards, because I actually really like Mockingbird. 51 games with 72% rollout. Dara's X-Men rollout? What the hell is this? Oh, it's an X-Men deck. 72%, 61% win rate? Jesus. Tier 0 Thanos. I don't have Thanos. 3 power Mockingbird. I don't have Gladiator. 
3,000 games? Dude, what the fuck? Ugh, God, this looks horrible. Patriot Surfer. That's literally like the deck I'm using. I mean, 33 games go. Toxic Mockingbird Double Up. That's the sound. That just looks mean. Mocking Brood. All these decks are so weird. Surf in the USA feature in Mockingbird. Chavez. A lot of power. Copy the code. We'll try it out. That one seems interesting. We'll just use it on a deck of all time. What's up, Kona? Thanks for lurking. Shout out to the lurkers. If you're lurking up in here, up in here, I appreciate it. All right, we'll try that. Seems interesting enough. I like throwing a lot of shit at the wall, trying a bunch of decks. It's always fun to try new decks out, you know what I mean? Always fun. Surprised you don't use untapped. I use everything. Parker! I, I use all of them. They have a hobgoblin in their hands. Okay. Hobgoblin. Great. Maria Hill. Surfer's now stronger. Uh, Ravona Renslayer. All right, so their Hobgoblin's now a four cost. They might try to play the Hobgoblin right here. So they play it, they'll be down, but just in case. Just in case they go for the goblin right here. Okay, they didn't. Now they're probably gonna play uh, Galactus on turn six. I'll throw it right back at him. <laughs> throw it right back at him, I don't care. Oh, why did I throw Patriot in the middle? I'm so fucking stupid. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Not the best first game. Escape. Mistakes were made left and right. Mistakes were made left and right, I can admit. I can admit my faults. Stun an avatar. Dior. 
That would be a very sick variant to have. But not today. I need my key. I don't even know what Cannonball does when he comes out on Tuesday. I don't even know what he does. I just know he's coming. Black Panther? Chase? Not revealed till the end of the game. I could throw Surfer down there. I could throw Patriot down there as well. Sleepy Bounce, a hot new emote that anyone can use. We have way too many Hyucks, but the Hyucks help fill out all the random emotes that we have, like Sleepy Poor, Sleepy Canada, Sleepy Arrive as a Worm, Sleepy Arrive as a Glizzy, with a Glizzy, not as a Glizzy, that's basically a worm. Cards cost one less. Oh boy, here we go, yo, here we go, yo. This is gonna get fucking messy. I'm gonna throw the Sinister down. You love Sleepy Arrive with a Glizzy. For some reason, people really do like Sleepy Arrive with a Glizzy. Ooh, classic no, discard by Chase. I like it. I am a fan. Oh, I could get a Brute from this. But I also could get, like, a Blue Marvel. Let's do it. Don't get brewed. That'd be very sad. Oh my god, I got brewed. Well, at least there's six power broods. That's a pretty good brood to have. That's a pretty good brood. I'm gonna throw Patriot and Surfer in on the left because they're not getting revealed to the end of the game. I love Sleepy Poor. <laughs> I think that one is really good. Oh, snap. I still think I win this with my Broodlands. If Mockingbird shows up, she'll basically be free. She'll be two cost. One cost because of Elysium. Okay. Okay. I have Mockingbird and Blue Marvel left. I could just play Doctor Doom on this last turn and get that last location in. I could play Doctor Doom right here. I'm gonna wait to see what we get. Forge Iron Man. I was thinking that, but I need. I want to see. Okay, well, I should have played something. I got the Blue Marvel, but mm. we'll just do Forge Iron Man. Should have done that last turn. Then I could have played Blue Marvel. You see, I'm an idiot. We'll have three, five, nine, thirteen. Well, thirteen power on the left. A lot of power in the middle, though. And a good amount of power on the right. I still think I win this, even with my lack, my lack of plays. They don't have. Dra they do have Dracula, I so. Am Iron Man. They going for a big apocalypse in the middle? Are they gonna go for like a Modok on the left, maybe? Oh, Gambit. I am apocalypse.
He really just sniped my best card. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Damn. I'm, fuck it, I'll upgrade a pixel, Mr. Sinister. You can't stop me. I've made decisions before. RNGs. I mean, it happens. What can you do? I, I can't even be mad. Losing against a discard deck like that, I like that discard deck. I really do. That's the discard deck I like. Classic Apocalypse. Can't even be mad at it. Now I just got Rock Slide, so now I can do an even better Dark Hawk deck if I wanted to. I mean, to be fair, I've had some pretty great Gambit snipes as well in my fair share of games. What up, Diggity Dan? Card stinky. Yeah. Yeah. Don't want to play Chavez in the middle. Oh, what a snipe. They probably think I'm cheating. <laughs> Work is waiting for you? What, are you late for work? Forge. Are we about to see destroy comps? Oh, God, I hate that. Oh, God, no. Can we not do that? I hope they have a magic. Because I don't. I'm gonna play the Iron Lad, and you're gonna be Iron Glad. If I double, if I clone Mr. Sinister, do I get a Sinister clone or do I get an Iron Lad clone? <laughs> It'll probably be a Sinister clone. Truly, I am shocked that we are playing against Destroy. That's Forge. Here, I'll do an Absorbent Man and copy the Forge boost. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a strong fucking Venom. I don't think I'll be able to beat it. Every game I play. Every game I play against Destroy. Escape. They have such... Every game against Destroy. I swear, there's fucking Shuri's Lab, Sinister London, all this shit that gives them the greatest cards ever. I play Destroy, I get Yotunheim. I got a key, so I got two keys going into this next week. I don't even really need the keys, though. Cannonball is the only thing I won't have, because I have Kitty Pride and... Miss Marvel already, and I have no credits again. You win every match, you don't start? This is true, this is true. What does can I need to know what Cannonball does, because I don't even know what he's good with. Oh, great. Let me guess. Deadpool? Well, at least I can play Forge. You know what? I'll kill you, Forge. Goodbye. I have Doctor Doom, so I can, I can win the Altar of Death. But he don't need to know that. 
All right, what, what about yet? Why would Cannonball be good with Deadpool? I didn't say Cannonball would be good with Deadpool. I had said I don't know what Cannonball is. And then I saw this location and said, oh, this guy's probably going to have a Deadpool. I didn't say anything about Cannonball being good with Deadpool. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Wayne Gretzky, Michael Scott. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Nope, there goes the Absorbent Man. AKA a card we didn't need. Doom rules all. A cheap Mockingbird is what we have now. I'll snap. I think I win this. I think I win this. I I win the middle, that's for sure. Doom is supreme, vengeance is mine. Maybe I should have shouldn't have said the sentences in such a short order, I guess. I am talking quite fast. You know me, I can't shut up. And they left. Victory. We also explained cannonball like 20 times. You guys have not explained cannonball 20 times. Maybe like two. Cannonball moves the highest power card to another location. If it can't move it, he destroys it and puts a rock there. Moves the highest power card. What, the highest power enemy card? I always forget about the spotlight. I just know what War Machine does and I hate it. War Machine makes me want to cry. I don't like War Machine. I don't like the idea of having a universal Jeff for one turn. Cannonball will freaking destroy a card. Highest Moves the highest power card to another location. If it can't move it, he destroys it and puts a rock there. That seems very, very OP. watch this game daily dude some people only watch marvel snap ow skip a turn let her ride well, that's unfortunate Okay. Go ahead. Destroy my entire deck. Destroy all the bad cards in my deck, even though Patriot's not a bad card. Yeah, give me a six power to Zorbin, man. Ten minutes left in the stream. Thanks for hanging out. Don't worry. It's Sunday. It's a longer than three-hour stream. If I play Brood, I can't really play that much. We're going to seven anyways. I'll do this. What the fuck? Did my team win last night? No, they lost in overtime. They lost in overtime. It was a 2-2 two two game and they lost 3. They lost with 0.5 seconds left in overtime before a shootout. It's respectable. I mean, it was a powerhouse game. It was two of the best teams in the conference going up against each other. So, it was a good game overall. I am. Q 
hear me out. What if I do this? Snap. I think that's a pretty good play. Forge into the Absorber Man, then the Absorber Man becomes Forge and goes into a Mockingbird. And then the Mockingbird goes to the right side. I shouldn't have snapped because they left, but... I won. You had a dream bird was playing Monster Hunter Iceborne and was fighting Toba Kadachi. Hate to say it to you, that dream will probably never come true. That dream will probably never become true. Go, Chavez. Ooh. I could give my opponent a free brood. Actually, I will do that. I won't do that. Pardon me. I'll play my brood to kill one of them, but I'll still have two in the altar of death. Oh, my cards can't become cheaper. Freaking Mobius. Is this a C3 deck? They are snapping on me. The good news is I win the right side. Doom rules all. I feel like I can just win the middle as well. He, he can only play two cards right here. And if he does play the two cards, he already has most of his power at 7-7. Seven, seven. Unless he has a blue Marvel, it would be 8-8. Eight, eight. They may want to Valk mid. Potentially. I have Absorbent Man and Blue Marvel and Forge. Last thing I played was Doom. By Iron Lad, I could get Forge, but they're revealing second. And I can't play anything else, so Forge would be useless. Cerebro and Mystique wouldn't really do anything. Actually, the Cerebro and Mystique would buff up my Doom bots. Would they not? That didn't do anything. That's unfortunate. What a play with the C3. I should have played the Doom on the right! Then I would have had a more powerful Doom bot on the left that I could have won. Ah, freaking Mockingbird was also shut off. 
I couldn't even play Mockingbird. Hey, Ninja Squirtle. Good old snap Rooney. Powerful card on that top deck. A nine powered Doctor Doom. Too bad his Doom bots won't be nine powered. I want to destroy that Dokken. Double Dawkins power. He'll be 8. He'll be 2. That'll be 10. He'll be 16. No, he'll be 10, 12, 14. I'd be at 13. Well, I'll give him a rock. Oh, I would have destroyed him. I would have destroyed him. Fuck. Modok. I am reborn. Well. What's it, the Chavez? Theirs? I don't know. Doom rules all. Hey, how come the Doom bots don't get extra power when Doom when Doctor Doom does? The Broods get extra power. Why doesn't Doctor Doom get extra power? Would that be too powerful? These are the questions I must ask myself. Only one card can be played here. That's horrible. Platypus! Sleepy D-U-M. Sleepy D-U-M. The tier two for 49 months, Platypus. I appreciate the support. I hope you're doing well. Thank you for the continued support. Big love for Platypus. Let's go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Happy today. Actually, I'm going to play the Absorbent Man and copy the Mr. Sinister. I'm also slightly addicted to snap, but I'm still not that great. It makes you feel any better? I'm not that great either. I kind of suck at this game. And according to the Twitch chat, I'm god awful. But it's fun, and that's what matters.
God damn it, man. He had a doom. Overthinking because you're dumb. Yeah, yeah, me too. So many games that I just lose because I stink. Oh, I can't. I'm stuck in 70 this season. I just need to find the deck that will win every game, you know? I could go back to my toxic deck of hazmat and all of that. But that was such a mean deck, but it was such a fun deck, too. What's up, Dawn? Actual Oilers fan? Uh, yes. I was watching the game last night and was very disappointed with the ending. <laughs> I went to the Bruins game against the Oilers last month. Fucking close one that they lost in overtime as well. Last night was, uh... Skinner was great, but... <sighs> what can you do? Play Gambit again? I could pull out the Gambit. Could pull out the Gambit. 0.5 seconds, I know. 0.5 seconds. Bouchard just had to stay on McKinnon for one more second. More at the trade deadline. They added a good amount. They did more than I expected, to be honest. After you play a card here, transform it. Oh, God. They did more than I expected. You know, the only thing we have is all positive, so I'm going to put Iron Lad down. It could be worse. Yeah, you could be bald and have a big nose. Yo! Wait, what did I even take? I took Patriot. Okay, that's fine. Yo, Don Kadick, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Yo, being an Oilers fan got me a Prime. Because I'm an Oilers fan, thank you. I love my Oilers. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. See you guys, being an Oilers fan has its benefits. Play the Forge, because then I'll get the boost on the Patriots still. And Sinister will get another boost. Constant heartbreak. <laughs> this is the year, Platypus. This is the year. This is the year. One Prime subscriber. I mean... Uh... Me and my partner, we lived in uh, Ontario until this year, actually. Until last year, actually. We moved to uh, Alberta. And now the Oilers are our little love. We love the Oilers. All uh, systems go. What are they going to do? What are they going to do to make me lose? What do I need to do to win? I got seven power. That is actually kind of perfect. This is coming from someone who grew up in Oilers fan. I was there for all those bad years. I uh, remember all those bad years. <laughs> I remember them. I always had a soft spot for the Oilers. I also really liked their colors before I got more into the hockey. Corvus Glaive, okay. I won. When we lived in Ontario, I told her I, t I couldn't be a Maple Leafs fan, though. I couldn't do it. My dad would roll over in his grave. Or my dad's ashes would roll over in the river I threw them in. <laughs> he knew I was a Maple Leafs fan. Listen, he wanted to be spread in a goddamn lake or a river. I don't know. I think it was a lake. We weren't supposed to dump there, but we did. I will say, though, Austin Matthews is quite fun to watch. He's got some game. It's debating if I should kill the Chavez, but... Oh, I should have waited! Well. He was a Canadians fan? Nah, he was a Bruins fan. 
because I'm from Boston. <laughs> Don't ask how I got from Boston to Alberta. It's a long story. He was a Bruins fan. I too like the Bruins, but I like the Oilers a lot more. Hey, thanks for giving me my entire deck. I appreciate it. Dude, I can't even ha- Oh man, you saw that coming. The Canadians are having a year. How I got there is actually a really short story. I drove. That's not true at all. I haven't driven a car in years. I haven't driven a car in years. Oh my god. Oh. Luckily, I got the Broodlands. So I have the three three cost Mockingbird. Uh, Doob's in. I could copy Sinister or Forge. I'm going to go for the Iron Lad. Oh, God. Don't fill out the whole location. Okay. No! It's filled with eight powers. I mean, that's a lot of power, I guess. Yeah, but fuck. Oh, God. Is he seriously going to do that to me? No fucking way he's going to do that to me. Ain't no way. C8 deck. Dude, he's about to throw two voids at me. What do I need to win this? How do I win this? I don't think... I have Sinister. I can get three cards down there, man. That It's going to get filled no matter what. That's the problem. I think I got to put Patriot down, though. That's for sure. Because I want to get these all powered up. I can play a Mr. Sinister in the Death's Domain if I need to, but fuck. Don't have Annie. Who am I kidding? You have Annie. He just needs eight power. And he wins. But I need to make Death's Domain a little bit more powerful. And then I can win. And the way to do that is to a forge into a Mr. Sinister. Also, hey, Shiny. Hope you're doing good. Good morning. I need to get my chance of winning this higher. I almost could have filled it. Should I have played the Sinister there as well? Then there would have only been one void. Maybe I should have played the Sinister there. Hey, they got the Dan Hip variant. I'm one away from that. Oh, no. Okay. Hey, I, I don't know if it would have won me, but it would have been closer than what I had. Because I did have the Patriot. God, it looks like I'm running a C2 deck. Okay. Uh, I changed one that I was working a little bit yesterday into this. 
I'm going all over the place with decks right now. I am Iron Man. Oh, that's convenient. I'm going everywhere with my decks. I don't know where. I don't know what to play. You were playing against a Hella deck last, and last round they were really relying on that Hella, and I had an opportunity to block it with a Cosmo, but I guessed the wrong location and they won. That sounds about right. Yeah, that sounds about right. Only have 20 power here if I do this. I could throw the Mockingbird right here, but I could also throw the Mockingbird right to help solidify that. I think I'm going to do that. That's a risk, but it's a risk I'm willing to take. It's a risk I'm glad I took. No, I lost by a point there. But I win everything else. It's fine. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Victory. I can't get out of the 70s, man. Freaking Eric Foreman's coming over here and telling me how bad I am. <laughs> Red Foreman's telling me he's gonna shove a foot up my ass. Dumbass. Freaking Raptors. Freaking Raptors. Will Merc for food. My hero. My king. Yeah, Mockingbird has the minus two initially, but now she's not going to show up. She's going to be at the very bottom of my deck. I know how this works. I know how this game works. If Mockingbird could show up, that would be awesome for the cloning vets. Well, that's unfortunate. There go the Raptors I were relying on. All right, well now it's a mine. Now it's not a minus two from Mockingbird. And Deadpool definitely needs to change his underwear. Saw that coming? That's usually how it works. We'll be sending the Doom bots in. Man, can you not? I don't want you. I wanted, like, Brood. Sometimes simple, just sweet and simple is all you need, you know? Doombots will be 10 power Doombots. That's pretty good. Get 10 power across the board. Oh, they're going to throw absolutely everything. Here comes a Carnage. Nope, another Venom because they're going to have, because they have two Venoms. Oh, Lord. What a game! Okay. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. Well, maybe he'll retreat. And then we'll tie, and I won't lose my one cube. Maybe two. 
my precious cube. Oh. Oh, we were waiting on me. Escaped. My one cube. Uh, who cares? It's a cube. Hey, there's Mockingbird. All right. What are we expecting for the Mockingbird nerf? They'll probably just lower her power. They'll probably just lower her by a couple power. Maybe make her a six cost instead, initially. I don't know. I do like Mockingbird as a whole though. I think she's pretty fun. <laughs> I think she's pretty fun. Got a gorgeous Mockingbird variant. Damn, you already got a Mockingbird variant? Your first card play here adds to the top power of your deck. Well, if that's the case, let's go Broodlands. What? Fucking Power Stone, probably. Jesus, man. All right, well, I got it. I got a cheap Mockingbird to go in there as well. All right, Mockingbird, what are you giving me? Yeah, I had a Mockingbird variant yesterday. Wait, I have the Mockingbird variant today for another two hours, I think. A 14 power Lockjaw. Okay. That is one strong fucking Lockjaw. <laughs> And I got a 12 powered balloon <laughs> Marvel. <laughs> hey, good to see you, boss. It's nice having you. You know what? He might just blob, so I could just do this. I don't think I'm gonna lose the left side. I can just Iron Man the right. That doubles my power. I am Iron Man. Maybe Shang Chi should kill every ten power card on that side, not just yours. Victory. Make them become absolutely useless. That, that doesn't make them useless. That makes them even better. Imagine if Shang-Chi killed your 10 power cards as well. Boom. Then you gotta really worry about it. Ain't nobody playing Shang-Chi. That's a nerf I would get behind. Shang-Chi ruins my life. Destroy buff. It only destroys 10 power cards. And I guess uh, it would buff destroy a little bit. But it's it's a risk where I'm willing to take this risk. I'm willing to take this risk. If you're not, just say so. Be a coward. Jeff! Jeff! Ooh. Wait a minute. I wanted to use Mr. Sinister. Because I was like, two four-power Sinisters could be pretty good. But an eight-powered Iron Lad could be pretty good as well. I'm going to do it, because I could I could get Surfer. But I could get Patriot. I'm going to do an eight-powered Iron Lad. It's the same as a two four-power Sinisters. 
And I could get Brood and have two more eight power Broodlands. <laughs> Gonna move that Jeffrey early. He probably knows the Forge Iron Lad is coming. Oh boy. Okay. You're about to be full because of that rock. Alright, we used that to boost America Chavez. Well, he can just move Jeffrey out of the way. can just move Jeffrey out of the way. Hey, Jeffrey. Uh, we can do Chavez on turn five. We'll do blue marble right now. Oh, he's playing super flow. Oh, he's locking down the super flow. Oh, he's getting rid of the super flow. Oh, come on, man. You gotta be kidding me. What the fuck is that? Hey, you're a learner. I'll be boosted up one card. If it's Mockingbird, I could play Mockingbird and Sinister. Oh, I didn't end my turn. You're right. Surfer. I feel like the left side's kind of locked down. It's a strong surfer. I don't think it's enough, though. He can still move Jeffrey. He will play Blob. You don't know what he's going to play. You could be right, but you could also be wrong. You were wrong. He played Shang-Chi. I am Iron Man. Now imagine that Shang-Chi killed the Call Obsidian and the monster as well. He wouldn't have played it. Ah, sure, that was a good one. Shang-Chi is just too strong for me, man. He just beats me down. A creamy white man. Oh, God. You have two... S That's convenient. Two notices. Let me check. I don't think it's anything. I think it's just n news... Now I'll skip my turn and get rid of the rocks. Motherfucker. What are the fucking odds of that? What are the fucking odds? You have got to be kidding me. There ain't no way this dude had an armor with that. Oh my god, I thought, wow. What great luck I have Mockingbird in my deck for the Collapse Mine. Then this guy has a damn armor.
Go ahead, give me that garbage. I'll take it. Go ahead. I'm not gonna use them. I don't need it. I won't draw another card for this game. I don't care. We won't have a lot of power, but it'll be hopefully enough. It will definitely not be enough. Fucker, man. I am Iron Man. Do I just get countered by everything? Like, what is happening? Oh my god, I almost won. Am I like, what is this? I'm gonna go be toxic for a game. I'm gonna be toxic for a game. You can't stop me. Look at my beautiful man thing. On anything, man. They will have Luke now, oh, most definitely. Let's send this to seven. Let's send it to seven. Zabu will make stuff cheaper. I can do Absorber Man into the hazmat. And potentially, we'll see what I get. If I pull debris, that'll be perfect as well. For God's sakes, man. I pulled debris, so... It would almost be perfect, but we'll have to settle for pretty nice. I'm not even going to snap.
I won. Victory. Maybe I just need to play my toxic deck again. Maybe that's all I need to play is the toxic deck. All right, one more game. I'm playing Snap for almost three hours. Toxic. Who knew all I needed to be was an asshole? Oh, that's nice. Playing Aliath? No, I'm playing Hazmat. Whoopsies. Whoopsies, nobody likes me. This guy's playing Shang-Chi off the rip, what the fuck? Playing Shang-Chi off the rip like that? Oh, I'm not gonna get hazmat now. Can Odin re-trigger Shang? Yes. Opponent snapped. Guys, this will be funny. Okay. This will not be funny. Never mind. This is horrible. <laughs> the good news is, I've won the left. What up, Matthew? All right, Odin. I hope he doesn't have a dark hog. Maybe it's time to bring back toxicity into our life. 